I've been farming here at Greystone Farm for about 15 years. Over the last 12 months, we've, um, we've had huge, huge changes, really. Um, 12 months ago, we had SOS Dairy, um, big crisis in the dairy sector. Um, since then, we've had, uh, we've had some rise in the milk prices, which has been good. Um, but also, we've seen the, the you know, voluntary code of practice between um, milk buyers and farmers. Um, so, so that is a code of practice where actually, um, yeah, contracts are are hopefully fairer and we've also seen an increase in, in milk pricing formulas as well which should be a little bit more transparent. Investment is, is vital for the dairy industry going forward and what is key for investment is both profitability but also confidence that think things are going to be right in the future. Confidence really comes from you know, higher up the supply chain. So I'm, I'm really looking for my milk buyer and, and retailers to really give positive signals to know that um, actually over the next five, ten years that, you know, there's a, there's a really secure future um, for, for myself as a dairy business. I'd like to see um, a better relationship between, you know, farmers and processors um, and, and the only way of achieving that really is with equitable contracts. If we could have 100% sign up to the Dairy Code of Practice, um, it would be fantastic and it, it, that would then become you know, commonplace in the industry. That would then give dairy farmers confidence. Um, that would then lead to farmers investing and also new startups. And then that would lead to, to a brighter future for, for the whole industry.